As a mother, she teaches her baby how to survive. This orangutan is getting its first climbing lessons. Its mother has been killed, so it fully depends on a human replacement. For some, these survival lessons can be tough. Victims of animal trade, many of them held as pets, are learning to become wild again, trying to abandon behavior they copied from humans. Human babysitters preparing them for their long anticipated release back into the wild. I'd be a really proud mother if my baby is able to survive in the jungle on its own, knowing what fruits to eat and knowing all these things about the forest I taught him. More than 600 orangutans are waiting to be released. Many have been for years. Except for their daily trips to forestry school, they are kept locked up, crammed together more and more every day. This orangutan is treated for shot wounds. For more than 12 years, the search for a secure forest in which to release them has failed, as the orangutans continue to be under threat all around Borneo. With the rapid disappearing forest, the wild orangutan population is reducing quickly. If we can't release them and can't protect the wild orangutans, for sure they will be extinct soon. This is the playground where the orangutans practice their jungle skills. It's a tragic reality that the animals have to be taught by humans how to survive in the jungle. And even if they're finally released, not all of them are going to make it. Like humans, it will all depend on their character and skills. But they can only prove it when they're finally being released from their long-term prisons. <laughs> Indonesia's president has pledged to release all orangutans by 2015. To achieve this goal, the government has given the Orangutan Foundation a forest for which it had to pay one and a half million U.S. dollars. The foundation says it's by far not big enough to release them all. Besides, it violates international regulations prohibiting mixing different species, something the government refutes. My question is, why don't they use the land they already have? <laughs> of course they are coming from different areas, but if we treat them in the proper way, I am sure it can be done. I simply don't believe it can't. No, I am not an orangutan expert, but this is just my common sense. To conservationists, that argument proves Indonesia has yet to show its full commitment to protect the orangutans against business interests and animal trade. Step fasten. Al Jazeera. Kalimantan.